200 yards. Take us to the basement parking lot in the middle park. Calculating route. Direct from Pole Beach. This is Radio yeah. Vladivostok. 200 yards. Turn right. Take these sticky bombs, Lois. We will need them for our news friends. Okay, give them here. I need that advanced MG too, if I want to take on the noose. It's good to have you with us, Louis. Yeah? Yes. It must be nice for you to get out from the other I big fucking army. shoot this guy! I don't know what you're implying, bro. Don't need me a partner. I got a stake in the Enterprise. <laughs> a stake? Sure. You still take orders from me, don't you? You can up your shit. Look. It could be much more than that, unless you're injured working for such a man, partner or whatever you call it. Really, bro? I don't know. When I was left to my own devices, I got locked up. At least with Tony's guidance, I ain't doing time. Perhaps, for now, perhaps. But do you think you're achieving everything you could? A man with your talents, in your condition, you could have anything you want. I didn't get to where I am without being able to see the world of man. It's real flattering, Mr. Bulgari. But whatever it is you're offering, you went after the guy. Me and Tony's is a business relationship. He gets his kicks elsewhere, but he's been a good boss for me and a good guy. Help me out. I'm not a fucking faggot! Whatever you say, bro. What are you talking about? I was saying that I may be interested in investing in your potential. Potential as what? As a businessman, I am looking for someone here in Liberty City with the correct relationship. I already got one employer. Like I said, he's been good to me. Of course! But what is he? He's a drug addict, a madman. You are useful to him, but you think that is all he wants from you? <laughs> when some new muscle-bound pretty boy comes along, he will forget about you and your precious stake in the Tony Prince Empire. Whatever, bro. Can we talk about something else? What am I doing here? You are helping me with my business. This don't seem like legitimate business to me, man. Nothing can be achieved here in Liberty City with actual things rooting through my affairs. For anything to happen, they must be eliminated. Okay, man. You really can't buy these people off? Sometimes a price is more effective if made out of lead, not gold. This is the first lesson I will give you. Okay. Hey, man, what's up? What do you mean, what's up? Where are you? Look, man, I, I'm taking care of some personal business. I'll come see you later, okay? I'm crunching up here, Luis. Hurry the fuck up. How long are you gonna be? I don't know, man. I, I, I gotta go. You must call. Yeah, man. See? And does he know that you are here with us? No. Interesting. I guess so. Please go down into the garage. Mark up this spot by the pillar. Please proceed to highlighted route. We will conceal ourselves. Place a bomb where they will not see it. Calculating route. Here we go. Calculating route. Calculating route. Calculating route. Well played. The bomb should prove quite a surprise for us. These guys are all crooked, huh? Marty has this in his pocket. The 
this news team is in charge of half the drugs running in the city. Do not let your conscience worry you. Dima, bro. You ain't talking much. You nervous? Be quiet. I see the target car. Let's set up this Russian and get out of here. Detonate when they come to the car, okay? Go, 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 go! is on the line. Hi, Estelle. I want you to know that I ordered the 50-inch whalebone sword of Solomon. That thing's ruling. I'm totally gonna kill that bitch cheerleader. Oh, honey, that's a beauty. Good girl. Religious swords have extra power, and we had this one blessed by a voodoo priest. I tell you, I get carried away with all these deals. Oh, this is a luxury. Hot, sexy luxury, like rich people have. Incredible value. You, you can't buy people for this much money. And I've tried. Are you picking up the Kingdom of Heaven collection? I sure am. If you find a better prize anywhere on the 19-piece ornate ceremonial sword collection, I'll eat crow. You'll also get this, the Gladiator 9. It's the ninth iteration of the popular Gladius, inspired by ancient Roman orgies. Its short stabbing motions are excellent in close quarter combat. This is old, ancient world-style Damascus steel. There are four kings of the beast happily mating on the handle. Woo! Woo! Look at the eyes of the lion done in gold on the handle. That's the last thing people will see. And this is the last you'll see of this collection. $99.95. Order now, honey. 19 ceremonial and historical sword collection. Oh, loser, they gonna get spoiled. How about this collection, then? Item number 1812, over 250 knives! If you could buy it, this collection would be worth upwards of $3,000 on the black market. What are they going to receive, Estelle? Oh, look at this one. Push a button. Bam! Knives open. Cops dead. There's a finger groove. That's a luxury switchblade excelsior. You'll get the Navy Seal. High carbon super density stainless steel for cutting underwater. Plus the bald eagle. It's glory. That's also a knife. Sing it with me. Glory be to the USA. Woo! With a wildlife scene on the handle. Do you see that, Luther? You're having a tough day at work. You can whip this buddy out. Look at that nature scene on the handle. Think about a more peaceful place away from meddling co-workers, sexual harassment regulations, and the do-gooders getting in the way of your business. You'll get the firefighter knife. 
Won't melt when you need to cut your way out of a burning building. What else can I do? 250 knives! A great value. These are working knives. These are ceremonial knives. These are ornamental knives. These are fantastic knives. One for under your pillow, in the baby stroller, in your briefcase, in the boot. This one right here makes me want to drop from a tree, slit a big cong neck, and light a torch, and run through the jungle, plumb naked on acid. Grab it, get it, buy it, let's move it. Ay-how! Get it up, bitches. Get you some knives. You're missing out. If you're watching, you should be buying. No explanation needed. We're running out of time. Remember, you need a knife. Order now. These deals can't last. Dial the number on your screen. We'll see you next time on the Serrated Edge. Remember, a knife is something that you can hold for it. Excellent, excellent, Max Kajakas. Oh, I still 
choose you. I pick you out because I see potential in you. You're lucky to be here. Yeah, great, thanks. But if you need more cops taken out, crooked or otherwise, you ain't choosing me. Look at this. The sensitive, modern American man. We need to go home and exfoliate your wolves. May as well cut them off. What the fuck is this? I don't like killing government agents, so I ain't got no balls. You're okay, calm down. We got no more law enforcement to expand. For now, those who are the only guys back ahead of us. You think he will sell? He has no choice but to sell. We have taken away his protection. It's that simple, is it? It should be. But he is a weakling. He lives here in exile, like all cowards. But he has been here for a long time, so he has more connections that others of us have not been able to acquire. This little trick should have severed a good deal of those connections and will give others involved a pause before they continue their association. Okay. Perhaps I will buy clubs for you as well. You sell them to me? The gloves is levers to the max already, man. I don't know if there's anything left to sell. I don't care about other They will forget about debts if I'm involved. Some of these investors aren't the type to go away. They aren't the type to pay off either. Anyway, it's not my place to sell them. I have a stake, but Tony's got the controlling share. Oh, uh, of course! Tony pulls the string, and the little puppet man bends for him. Let me know when Tony next has hand up your ass, and run through it with Dami can talk. Fuck, man. What's wrong with you? Your stake is bullshit. You think you run the club, but you are still just security. You are Tony's gimp, and you won't admit it. It's not like that. This what you want to do your whole life? No, but seriously, bro. I have opportunities for you. Think about them. Think about what I said to you. The offer will not be there forever. Okay, I will. Send my regards to Big Tony.